Hello and welcome to the Jeremy Kyle Show, where we take awkward social situations and turn them into a bloodbath. On today's episode, we will be discussing the theme of My Wife Cheated On Me <laughs> With God. That's right, after a thousand plus episodes, we are really struggling for ideas. Please welcome to the stage, Joseph the Carpenter. Hello, Joseph. Hello, Jeremy. So, I understand your wife cheated on you with another man? Why did you say it like that? I honestly have no idea. Well, yes, she did. Do you feel somehow to blame for this? Does your wife have a reason to sleep with another man? Not that I know of. I see here that your wife is the Virgin Mary. Could that be the problem? Um, I don't know. Shut that. up! I'm talking! So, can you briefly describe what happened when you found out your wife was pregnant? Well... I'll get it, mate. What, Ray? Hey, I got some wonderful news for you. What, Ray? Well, first of all, I just polished my wings so they're all sparkly, but I need to come in to give you the big news. Well, I bet you better come in then, didn't you, Ray? Oh, I will, if my thighs will let me. Bender. So, what's the news, Ray? Well, just between me and you, girlfriend. You're pregnant! Yay! I'm pre- Yeah, so why the glum face? I'm not ready to have a very pet. I'm only 15. And that's what happened. Yeah. Okay then, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage, Angel Gabriel. Gabriel. Ooh, call me Gabe. Action. So, Gabriel. Gabe. Who told you to inform that slag, I, I mean Mary, that she was pregnant? Only the big man upstairs, you silly goose. Do you know that God is the father? No, but I did read that Katie Price might be getting married again soon. <sighs> well, you have been helpful. Please welcome our next guest, Mary! Wait, why am I sat in that chair? Ah! Yes, Mary. So, so, Mary, what did you do when you found out you were pregnant? Same thing I always do, Mary. Ah! <laughs> well, usually baby dies, and then it's all that's normal within two weeks. One second, Mary. Damn budget cuts. Yes, Scott! How can you even say that, mate? I mean, school means a four-letter word. It's hard to say. I had an affair with your husband, and then you try to kill your unborn child. Get out! You... Get out of my studio! Are you saying I didn't succeed, mate? Crap, I left the baby in the car! Next, please welcome to the studio a witness from when Mary gave birth. Please welcome Steve and Gerard! Alright. So Stephen, take us through the events of the day that baby Jesus was born. Stephen, what about the rumours that you are now Irish? Uh, I can't say anything to do with that. Uh, I think uh, there's something in my voice and people just get it confused quite easily, but I need to follow that. Goodbye. Hey, look at that star. Do you think it means something? Do you want to go on an adventure with me? I don't know. Last time I got, went on an adventure with a man like you, the papers talked about it. Oh, come on. It'll be fun. Yeah. I spy with my little life. You know, if you don't shut up, I'm gonna put a bullet in your I spy two very important people. <laughs> hey guys! Fuck my life. The water's broken and we have nowhere to stay because there's no room at the travel ends. We'll be right back after this commercial. <laughs> And we're back. Now we're going to be talking to these three chavs about what they recall. Hey, well, my name's Bill, and, and this is what happened, mate. 
so we was lacking out in the alley, right? And then this this guy comes up to us. Okay, I'm gonna be f quick because this place smells. Um, basically, follow that star, and this is baby, and you need to give him stuff. Everywhere I go, bitches always know the Charlie scene has got a weenie that he loves to show. Bitch. So, why did you get for baby me? Well, I was gonna go out and get him some MCAT, but I couldn't find me trainers. What did you get him, mate? I got him your trainers, you fat mama sausage. What did you get him, mate? Wake up, grab beer, grab rear, shave beer, put on some steam gear. Gotta get drunk till my mom wakes up, break up with my girl so I can bang sluts. I'm on dead, I'm fat. Guys, peeps, we got a shame. Ew, 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 ew. I wanna call him Keith. Or what about Jesus? No, I wanna call him Keith. You're calling him Jesus. Or uh, I'm calm. I'm calm. Wait, 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 wait. You, you're telling me your wife has an affair with God, and that he is the father. Sounds about right for this show. But she still cheated on me. Right. Alright, enough of this. There's only one way to settle this, mate. Ooh. I demand This show makes absolutely no sense at all. So guys, let's go sing some Christmas carols! Yeah! Yay! And stuff. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, get oh, fun if you do right on the one horse, so please don't Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle.